Yo, yeah, what's going on, guys, and welcome back to Adventure Time Balloon Tower Defense. I couldn't be bothered looking for a different game, to be fair. So, the reason why I came back here is because there's actually more characters. And one of them, as you can see, you need to do a certain star rating. So, let's go and find. Where is she? FP. Oop. I didn't get daily stuff. So, where's FP? FP. Oh, FP's here. So as you can see, the Flame Kingdom is... You can unlock the Flame Princess, but... You need to do it difficulty silver. Hmm. Uh, let's see. So, sorry about that small cut there, guys. <laughs> oh, it's been in Jake. Okay. Um, sorry about that small cut. It basically... The advert... There was an advert and it... Now that you've done certain areas, adverts come up, and it's kind of annoying. So as you all know, there's Max, you have Finn, Jake, PB, Ice King, I got Class, I got Cassie, but I've also got the original Dark Monkeys, which is quite decent. So my first goal, getting, wait, why have I got... Why have I got the Sausage Knights? Hot Dog Knights, I think they're called. Whatever they're called. All right. So, the first person I really want to get, mainly, is PB. Because PB attack can actually remove the recovery balloons. Which becomes really useful. And at the moment, it's quite an easy task to just leave Finn to do that and then have Max nearby. As Max is quite powerful especially with his upgraded dart it's a shame I can't put this girl down somewhere so PB you need to be close and Don't worry, everyone. I have a plan. Ready. so as you can hear yes they still have they actually have done voices for every character literally I was quite amazed by it myself as you can see, I might have got a new weapon for PV. And it's quite powerful. So I love the aspect of the fact that you can equip different weapons to different people. And the weapons change. The actual appearance on the game. You actually see the weapons being used. So let's see. I need 700, there we go, she can now see camo balloons and also remove any balloons that have healing, so the heart balloons basically become useless now, let's give her more fire, with Max being there, Max will, oh, well, I have Max for that reason, personally. With it being like this, I have equipped Max with the ability of healing. So after, after a round is over, Max will automatically regen. Uh, um, heart, three hearts, call me. And I think if I lose a heart, he also regen another heart. I think it's that. So it kind of made Max slightly overpowered. Yeah. Hmm, this seems a lot easier than the other ones have been doing. Out of all the characters in this game, I've got to say I still love the classic monkey. The classic dark monkey. Due to the fact that I when I first heard about this game, it was Balloon Tower Defense. And it was literally the original. And it was fun. And it still is fun. Just now it's getting complex with having different people in adding in different universes. 
in this as well. Uh, let's give you the extra dark. So the good thing about this game is you can actually upgrade your characters like in There we go guys, the balloons, the heart balloons. As you can see when the heart balloons, if PB is able to hit them, the heart balloons lose their ability to regen. Oops, let's speed this one up. The heart balloons lose their ability to regen. There we go. They should lose their ability to regen. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, see? They lose their ability to regen when PB fires her uh, science on it on them. I don't know what to call it, so I'm just calling it science guys. Ooh, there we go. Balloon increases damage. And also she wipes away any and all camo. So she's kind of overpowered in terms of speaking. Let's see. Hmm. If I had to, since I'm watching the original, well, Dragon, well since I'm watching Dragon Ball Z and not Kai, and also Dragon Ball has got a certain character, in, I kind of think who'd be Mr. Simpson. Hmm. All honesty, it's actually good. Ice King. You can go there for now. That's right, I need to give Max the lead destroyer. Let's see. As you can see guys, literally they were camo and PB revealed, basically. I need wizardry eyes. Wizardry eyes. Wizard eyes. Allows. Well, basically allows it. Ooh. Or oh, do I pop more layers? Pop more layers. This is the actual first time I've ever used the ice cream properly. I've never really bothered with him. He just hasn't seen that much of a useful character. Hmm. Let's have the hot dog men there. Oh my god. He fires. He's basically the dark tower. Ice King is basically the dark, the dark tower. Hey, actually, what's the idea? So here we go, guys. All the layers they can go through requires level seven. I need to upgrade that. Need ice arrow equipped. Wow. Let's see, Max. Max has nearly completed hot top. So that's next. This is quite decent. Sharp weapons range. Hmm. Not too really afraid of everyone else. I feel kind of unfair. You know who else needs to come on? The banana man. Let's get. I know I can get a certain amount of dark monkeys. So let's bring the dark monkeys around the banana man. And we need 400 for the last one. You can go there. 
That's all the allies now on the game. Let's see if we can upgrade Jin a bit more. Like, this is quite cool, because if, if they keep playing games like this, it'll be fun. Because it's bringing games that, well, it shows that people love on the TV. I'm giving it with a classic game like, well, Blue Tower Defense. I've always personally liked the Blue Tower Defense series. So, it's really cool. Gives Cash and Life to the end of each round, that's the one I wanted. Lucky enough, I slowed that down there. Let's see, let's see if we can upgrade from these monkeys. Laser scope, increase the range. So, as you can see, some balloons still make it through. Sad to say, but it's one of the things we gotta get used to. Ooh, that's right. So you can upgrade every, every allied unit. I don't know why they can't. This little guy should be able to pop the balloons. Personally speaking, guys. Wow. Let's just... So, I brought you onto the pause menu quickly because there is another feature which I am about to activate. It's called Auto Start. So, basically once this round's over, automatically starts the next round, which is quite handy. Let's just do this. No, I need that one. So, as you can see, I'm guessing next is I'm going to regret doing this mission. Wow. They did a lot of numbers onto these. I'm hoping PV can uh, get rid of all the hearts. There's no way I can see me surviving this. As you can see, it offers help. How, how long was that actual mission? Christ, that's actually quite long. So, as you can see, you need to do challenge 4. And the way to better your characters is by upgrading them. One of the ways to upgrade is to do that. Click get more, and it will either take you to the shop. Not my cup of tea. Or. No. No, I didn't want the shop. Or use co two cosmic essence. Or you can get cosmic, e cosmic essence. The other way is, as you saw there, certain items. If I click on that map, it will say. Hmm. Normally it sell tells you what it gives you. So, let's come back out. So, if we go to the. I'm guessing. Let's go to Sugar Pump Kingdom since. Sugar Pump. Candy Kingdom. So, she's blocked there. Ooh, that's right. As you saw before, you can actually unlock certain characters. Unlocks a new version of Princess Bulgum. And it's. actually quite fun. So. As you can see, yet again, it's the gold one, it needs to be unlocked. The silver one, it needs to be done on all of them. So, but if I click on play, I'm pretty sure this gives me Finn's Cupcakes. But basically, yeah, Finn's Cupcakes. So basically, guys, quickly, adverts are put on this, so it's kind of slightly 
more irritating. So, basically with this, I can get Finn's cupcakes to upgrade Finn. And I don't think I need to upgrade, actually, my character. Ow. I don't think I should need to upgrade my characters. So, with this, guys, basically, I can get more heroes to use. Banana. Banana Knight. But, um... Once, sadly, yeah, there's adverts when it after you've done the area once, there's an advert that comes up. So once you've done the advert once, eh, it doesn't matter. It's like 30 seconds, something like that. Gives you a little time to think about what you're going to go in with a strategy. If you're going with the same pattern or changing up. The other one is the fact that you can uh, send things need require. Uh, and so yeah but as I say with doing this I can get Finn upgraded and get Max upgraded by going to find Max's uh, bananas Max needs bananas Jake I think needs Jake cupcakes and PB needs PB of cupcakes or something like that each of them have their own requirements which is quite useful and handy when it's when you're doing stuff like this so, Hopefully you guys enjoyed today's episode, if you have please leave a like, comment and subscribe, and I'll see you guys all next time. Well, bye guys.